So I'm going to show you how to set up multi-point average control in SimCenter Test Lab for closed loop vibration control. And using sign setup, I'm going to show this process, but you'll find the similar process is in random control. So everything I show is applicable for random control. So the first step in the process is to first come into the channel setup worksheet. And once I have my sensor information put into the worksheet, I can then pick and choose which which sensors will be used for either measurement as a measurement sensor or as a control sensor. And in this case I've got four control sensors and I've got these at point number two, point number three, point number four, and point number five. So that's the information that I enter in the channel setup for the average control. Then I go into sign setup and here it's just a simple matter of establishing the control strategy for average control. And this is another pull-down menu and you can see there's three different choices. I'm going to use the first choice of average control but also there is a choice for maximal and minimal control. So you can see that the steps are pretty straightforward and simple for setting up multi-point average control in SimCenter Test Lab.